Coach, I know not the end result you guys were hoping for coming up here, but uh, just your thoughts tonight. Well, the kids, uh, they fought hard. Um, obviously, we came out pretty strong first half and leading at halftime, and um, things just kind of got away from us there in the second half. They obviously made some good adjustments, and we tried to make some adjustments as well, but uh, just couldn't quite keep up with them there in the second half. Yeah, you guys went into the half up um, on the two-time defending state champs. What was the message to your team going into the locker room? Just keep doing what we're doing. Um, we had to tighten some things up. We made some good adjustments, actually, from the first quarter going into the second quarter. Um, just kind of calmed down a little bit. And um, But, again, the kids battled, and I just told them to stick with it. And um, they busted a couple of big plays there in the second half. And, you know, we were in it there till the end. We were only down 10, really, till that last score. And um, thought we were going to have a shot to, to come back again on them. Oh, when you look back at this, they had, I think, three touchdowns in about three and a half minutes. Is there anything looking back that maybe you feel like you guys could have done differently? I'll always go back and question my, my decisions, uh, make sure they're the right ones. And I probably screwed up 100 times tonight um, and play calls. I'll go back and, and figure that out later. But, you know, one of the goals was keep the ball out of their hands. I knew they could score quick, um, and I was trying to keep the ball out of their hands. And by and large, we did that for the most part. I'm sure we probably won the time of possession pretty easily, but... Um, Again, they just they can score so fast. They're so high powered, and they got, you know, arguably two of the best skill kids in the whole state over there. So, yeah. Yeah, Hunter Deckers. Um, you guys kept him kind of contained in the first half. He was able to make some plays in the second half. But how do you feel like your defense fared against them tonight? Well, once we got through that first quarter, we made, uh, like I said, we made a couple adjustments defensively in the second quarter and, and tightened some things up pretty well. And, um, you know, we, we stopped the run all night tonight. For the most part, there were some scramble yards they got, and um, they got a lot of yards after contact, and we didn't tackle very well at the beginning of the game and started kind of creeping back in the second half, some poor tackling. But, um, again, our, our kids, they worked their butts off. They, were, they never quit, so I'm, I'm super proud of them. A lot of really talented seniors that suited up in trainer for the final time. Uh, how do you sum up this season in their careers? Well, I'll tell you the same thing I told them after the game, that right now it's uh, it hurts and it's hard, and this probably won't make sense. Um, the feeling we have right now is we were really, really close. Um, but in time, they're going to look back and realize how far we came. And we came a long ways. And when they were freshmen, we were 1-8. and eight, And I think we scored 52 points all year long. And um, this year, we were almost averaging that a game. So... Um, they've carried us a long ways. They've set the tone for the future and, and showed the younger kids the right way to do it.